Alright, so the basic shape of the pineapple is an oval. And sometimes I'll do this, but I didn't this time, where I start with a straight vertical line to guide me so that I don't tip to the side. Um, and then what I want you to notice is the height of the body of the pineapple versus the how much height is in the leaves. And there's actually more leaf height than there is pineapple, so you could also kind of sketch that out before you start. Again, I didn't, but that's a good gauge to help you to get those proportions correct. I'm not following every single tiny leaf exact because, oh my goodness, how horrible would that be? But what I do like is just to pick a few leaves here and there and try and mimic that. I'm drawing super light because um, I'm going to watercolor this and watercolor paint shows every ounce of pencil marks. So I really like to use um, this 0.5 lead for my watercolor paper. And then I'm going to go back through and I'm going to ink it. I like these microline pens, and this is a 0.35. I've zoomed in so you can see it, and I just fly. Look how fast I draw, I'm so talentedly fast. But seriously, once the ink is dry, then I like to use my kneaded eraser and go back through and erase the pencil, and that's because the kneaded eraser doesn't rub the surface of the watercolor paper or damage it, so it's super slick. I'm not doing a lot of detail, just a basic outline so that I can see my lines. I know I'm going to ink it when I'm done, and so I like to ink it before. Now these are Winsor Newton watercolors, and for the yellow, I'm trying to get a pale yellow, and then I want to get a shadow um, color for the shaded side of my pineapple. And a lot of times what I'll do to dull down the brightness is use its complementary color purple, so that's why you saw me pulling some reds and blues to create a little bit of that contrast um, to calm down that bright purple. And with my green, I've already mixed a black. It seems black, but really it's ultramarine blue and my um, brown. You in here, babe? And then I'm just not doing every detail of the uh, of the leaves, but what I'm doing is giving um, just the gesture that there's color. So I'm doing the right side is darker, and then I pull in some water and fill in the leaves with my lighter, and then. To me, I just needed more, and you don't have to do this, but I liked the idea of splatting and giving it more texture. The paper I chose wasn't really big enough, so I got really wimpy, tiny splats, but it worked. And then I let it dry, and now I'm going back through with another microline ink pen that's a 0.25 millimeter, and I was not satisfied with the quality of this video. Not this portion was a little blurry, but this is my end result, and um, yeah, it was fun. I liked the pineapple.